Hello everyone. My name is Saurabh Bansal. Today we are going to solve the problem of the day. So the problem of the day, the question name is reverse words. So basically, the question name is reverse words where they have given you a string str and we have to reverse the string without reversing its individual words. Okay. So what that question means? Actually, this question is very easy. Okay. So basically, they have given you a string like this. I like this programming very much. And you can see over here that uh, in between the words there is some dots like this okay so there is some dots like this and we have to reverse the string on the basis of this dots okay so what is going to be the output of this program after reversing it that you can see over here that we have to reverse the order of the words okay so firstly the much will come over here then very then program this i like i okay so this is kind of output i think the question is very clear because it's very easy as well so uh, now this is the question. So what we have to do in this question is, so now let's understand the approach of this question. So approach is going to be very easy. So there is one method in the string is that we can split the string. Okay, we can split the string. Okay, now let's understand the split method. Okay, so if we split this uh, string, the whole string, in, if the string according to this dot, okay, if we just if I just uh, split this string according to this, basically a dot. So what is going to be the happen after applying the split method? This is going to be converted into an array of kind of this thing. I then the second element is going to be like. Then the third element is going to be this. Similarly, the whole string is going to be presented in an array and it will be separated. Uh, according uh, separated on the basis of this dot okay so this is how we have to separate the whole string after this okay so uh, let's increase the space of the array very and much now what i can do over here is after getting this array okay after getting this array like this what i can do is what i can do is uh, i can traverse from the last from the array okay what i will do i will uh, make another string and I will concatenate the other string with this. Okay. From the last, I will uh, start travel. Firstly, I will add much. Then I will add one dot. Then I will add very. Then I will add dot program. And similarly, I will traverse from last to first, first element. Okay. So this is how I will travel. And at the last, at the last, I will get this uh, string. But wait for a while. But after getting the whole string, but after getting the whole string, let me let us take one more example, one short example so that we can understand it very well. Okay, so let's take this example very well. V. Okay, let's say we have taken this example. Now, what is going to be the output of this? So the output we want is V dot well dot very. We want this output. Now, after splitting this string on the basis of this dot, what we are going to get? We are going to get very. Then we are going to get well, and then we are going to get v like this. Okay, so this is going to be the array. Now we will traverse from the last. But firstly, we will take a empty string. Okay, we will take a empty string. Let's say string answer. We will take a empty string like this, and we will add. Firstly, we will add the last element. Then we will add a dot. Okay. Then we will add well. Then we will add one more dot. Okay. Now when we add very. So according to the algorithm, we also we are also going to add this last dot. So uh, now this dot is extra in this part. Okay. So before returning the answer, we have to remove this dot. Okay. We have to just remove this dot. Okay. After returning the after removing the dot, this is going to be our answer. So this is going to be approach. Okay. So let's see how to do that question. Okay. Let's move on to the code part. Okay. So in the code part, you can see over here. Firstly, I, what I have done is okay. Let's change the color of the pen. Okay, so firstly, what I have done over here is that I have splitted the string in a form of array. Now this array is of type of string. Now I've taken a string builder because we uh, in Java language, if we are doing the code in Java language, so uh, as you know that uh, concatenation in string is an exp expensive uh, uh, thing. So that's why I'm using the string builder class of the string. Okay, firstly, what I've done is I have used a for loop for this part. I'm for moving from the last to the first element. And I am appending the last string as well as the dot. Okay, you can see over here. Okay, so this is how we are doing moving in this part. And now after this, I have converted the string 
uh, after after that i have converted this string builder to the string now this is going to be my answer now i have for removing the last dot i have used the method that is called substring okay so now i've got answer answer to now i've written the answer to over here like this okay let's run this program okay so this is correct okay let's try to submit it as well okay so this is submitted as well okay so uh, that's all for this video hope you have liked this video uh, thank you